Welcome to Black Gumbo Southern Gardening. Samuel and I are going to release some ladybugs in our garden. Come and learn why. <laughs> So Sam Samuel has this book we like to use. What's it called? It's called Good Bug, Bad Bug. Good Bug, Bad Bug. And this is a good book to have. It's, it's, it's kind of targeted to kids, I think, but it's really suitable for all gardeners. Let me see that book. So it'll show you in this kind of a book what, uh, what's a pest, like bagworms. Everybody knows bagworms are a pest. And uh, so you've got all these pests in here. And some of these we've seen in our in our garden, like spider mites. Ooh, let me see if there's spider mites in here. Spider mites. We have spider mites right now in our garden. And that's why I purchased some bags of ladybug beetles. Why don't you find the ladybugs in there? It says, adult ladybugs and their larvae help, you help rid your garden of aphids, asparagus, asparagus beetle larvae, mm -hmm. co Colorado potato beetle larvae, Lace bugs, mealy bugs, Mexican bean beetle larva, scale spider mites. Spider mites. That's what we need. All white right. flies and eggs of several other insects. So these dudes do a lot of good for us, huh? Yeah. Awesome. There are I so can feel them. Yeah. Ah. Now you're supposed to take these. Um, first of all, I, I bought these on Amazon, and they come with a lot of kid packaging and kid-friendly information. Um, I, uh, <laughs> I chucked that out already, sorry, sorry about that. But these look like they're mostly adults in here, if not all adults, and they're in good shape. The, the postman brought them today, and it was a little warm out there. They say you're supposed to put these in your garden in the evening or at the, in the morning, and I suspect that that's so they won't uh, take off and fly away and they'll they'll just kind of settle in and so we're it's it's evening close enough to evening here we're going to go release these in our garden and they make you itchy yeah they're kind of cool if they were crawling on you you'd be itchy Ooh, look at their little legs coming through let's go find somewhere to put them we got three bags of these so we need to put them maybe uh some in our one in each garden bed i think they all want to go up This eggplant had some spider mites on it, and it looks like these guys are already kind of looking for food. Yeah, that's what I want to see right there. That. We're going inside this pole. That's all right. Look at all those. <laughs> you just shake the pole. These guys are predatory and they eat all kinds of bad bugs and so they're really good to have in your garden. They're one of the better beneficial insects you can possibly have in your garden. So if you see a ladybug, ladybird beetle, don't kill it. It's a good beetle. Phoebe, get out of the bugs. <laughs> and so a lot of them are hanging around but a lot of them are flying off. I suspect that you, you should expect that. Now I wonder how long we'll continue to see these. If they fly all the way tonight or tomorrow and they don't do anything for us, uh, I guess that's the way it goes. But I see a lot of them kind of spreading around and exploring. Oh, they're all made me over my face and one's in my shirt now. This is what I want to see right here is beetles hanging around and looking around and crawling around. What do you think? You think it'll that's work? A lot. You think it'll work? You think yeah. they'll eat our spider mites? Yeah, considering <laughs> there's one even on your hat. Yeah, they're right going to be all over. We'll be finding these for days. So it says that a, a single ladybug <laughs> can consume up to 5,000 aphids in its brief lifetime. Um, spider mites are smaller than aphids, so I hope that they consume up to 10,000 aphids. It also says that their larvae eat uh, the, the bugs and, and are, are predatory as well. So that's good. Is that one right there? Yep. 
There's a bunch on you. We're going to be finding them for a long time. Well, um, that that's good to have. We're 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 really happy to see these critters in our garden and uh, happy to let them go. And uh, it's fun to do. So, if you got a little boy and you want to have a little bit of fun in your garden, buy a couple of bags of ladybugs, and uh, they'll crawl all over you and they'll crawl in your hair and they'll get all over you like that. There's yeah. A bunch on your hat. <laughs> Thank you for joining us on Black Gumbo. Please subscribe to our channel if you haven't done so already. Like our Facebook group and our uh, Instagram account, and we'll see you next time. Take care.